In 1798, amidst the enchanting land of Egypt, where ancient wonders and timeless tales resided, a brave adventurer named Napoleon Bonaparte found himself at the awe-inspiring Giza Pyramid. With a heart filled with curiosity and a mind teeming with excitement, Napoleon made a bold decision that would forever alter the course of his life. Little did he know, this night would be unlike any other. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting enchanting hues across the desert landscape, Napoleon prepared himself for a unique experience, spending a night within the ancient walls of the majestic pyramid. With torch in hand, he cautiously entered the grand structure, feeling the weight of history pressing upon him. Welcome to another exciting episode of Raven's Cozy Corner of Curiosities. Get ready for a mesmerizing journey through the sands of time. Today, we embark on an extraordinary expedition to unravel the enigmatic world of ancient Egypt. Brace yourselves as we delve into a realm where majestic pyramids pierce the sky, where sacred hieroglyphs whisper tales of a civilization's legacy, and where mighty pharaohs ruled as gods among mortals. In this enthralling quest, we shall uncover the mysteries that lie beneath the surface. We'll explore the captivating presence of extraterrestrial beings in the annals of ancient Egypt, where whispers of cosmic visitors intertwine with the legends of pharaohs. And finally, the pièce de résistance of our expedition, Napoleon's Night in the Enchanted Giza Pyramid. Let me take you on a journey to ancient Egypt, where a remarkable architectural marvel stands tall and proud. There are over 100 pyramids in Egypt. Pyramid of Djoser, affectionately known as the Step Pyramid holds the distinction of being the oldest stone building in the world, dating back to around 2630 BCE during the reign of Pharaoh Djoser, which means 2600 years before the birth of Cleopatra. The largest Egyptian pyramid is in Giza, near Cairo. It is commonly referred to as the Great Pyramid of Giza, the Pyramid of Khufu, or the Pyramid of Cheops. It was built as a tomb for the Pharaoh Khufu during the Old Kingdom period of ancient Egypt. The Great Pyramid of Giza is indeed the largest pyramid in terms of its original height and mass. It was originally approximately 146.6 meters tall, although its current height is slightly shorter due to erosion and the loss of the outer casing stones. The construction of the Great Pyramid is a remarkable feat of engineering and represents the apex of ancient Egyptian pyramid building. It was constructed using an estimated 2.3 million limestone blocks, each weighing several tons. The precision and scale of its construction have fascinated people for centuries. The Great Pyramid is part of the larger Giza Pyramid Complex, which also includes the pyramids of Khafra and Menkore, as well as the famous Sphinx. The Great Sphinx is an iconic monumental sculpture carved out of limestone. It depicts the body of a lion with the head of a human, commonly believed to represent a pharaoh, possibly Khafra. It is the largest monolithic statue in the world, measuring about 73 meters long and 20 meters tall. But hey, as we're here around the Giza complex, let's revisit the thrilling story of Napoleon as he ventured into the mesmerizing Giza pyramid. Inside the pyramid, the air was thick with mystery and whispers of forgotten tales. The walls, adorned with intricate hieroglyphics, seemed to come alive under the flickering glow of his torch. As the night unfolded, a symphony of creaks and whispers danced around him. Each sound carried the secrets of the past, blending with the echoes of distant pharaohs. Napoleon's excitement mingled with a sense of trepidation, making his heart beat faster with every passing moment. When dawn finally arrived, the first rays of sunlight seeped through the narrow cracks in the pyramid's walls. Napoleon, a mixture of exhaustion and exhilaration, emerged from the depths of the ancient structure. But as his feet touched the sandy ground, he felt an inexplicable chill run down his spine, sending shivers through his entire body. Don't forget we're talking about Napoleon. He was always a tough guy, but even he couldn't believe what he saw. The world outside had transformed. The familiar landscape of golden dunes and shimmering horizons was replaced by an ethereal beauty that defied description. The pyramid stood tall and proud, emanating an aura of otherworldly power. 
Napoleon's eyes widened with amazement and a touch of fear, realizing that something extraordinary had occurred during his night in the pyramid. As he ventured forth, Napoleon encountered the friendly locals who, with warm smiles, shared their tales of a mystical night. They spoke of ancient spirits and benevolent pharaohs, whispering legends that had been lost to time. Their words painted vivid images of a hidden world that coexisted with the one he thought he knew. But hey, let's dive deeper into the captivating world of ancient Egypt. By the end of this video, we might just unlock the secrets that could give us a glimpse into what Napoleon encountered on that mind-boggling night. Get ready for an exciting journey as we uncover the wonders of this ancient civilization. It's like connecting the dots and piecing together a puzzle to unlock the enigma that left Napoleon in awe. So, grab your popcorn and buckle up, because we're about to embark on an adventure that will leave us with more questions than answers. Hieroglyphs were not your ordinary run-of-the-mill alphabet, they were a pictorial language that allowed the ancient Egyptians to express themselves in a truly unique and captivating way. Imagine being able to communicate using pictures. Well, that's precisely what hieroglyphs offered. They were a combination of ideograms and phonetic signs. This marvelous writing system allowed the Egyptians to tell stories, record historical events, and even document their deepest beliefs and rituals. Let's talk about a true hero of history, the Rosetta Stone. This marvelous artifact was discovered in 1799 by a group of French soldiers during Napoleon Bonaparte's expedition to Egypt, which we'll talk about it later in a separate video. It's like stumbling upon a treasure chest full of secrets. What makes the Rosetta Stone so special is that it provided the key to unlocking the secrets of hieroglyphs. Thanks to the Rosetta Stone, scholars like the brilliant Jean-Francois Champollion could finally crack the code of hieroglyphs and reveal their secrets to the world. It was like solving an ancient puzzle, and it opened up a whole new understanding of ancient Egyptian civilization. When we talk about ancient Egypt, we should talk about pharaohs who ruled with regal splendor and dynasties who shaped the course of history. Pharaohs were not ordinary kings. They were considered divine beings, the earthly representatives of the gods. Imagine that. These extraordinary leaders held immense power and were believed to have a direct connection with the divine realm. Egyptian history is divided into periods called dynasties, which were essentially ruling families. Each dynasty marked a new era of power and authority. The most well-known dynasty is the mighty 18th dynasty, which saw the reign of powerful pharaohs like Hatshepsut, Akhenaten, and Tutankhamun. Oh, and speaking of Tutankhamun, his tomb's discovery in 1922 by Howard Carter was an absolute treasure trove, revealing stunning artifacts that offered a glimpse into the opulence of ancient Egyptian royal life. Ramses II, also known as Ramses the Great, was the longest reigning pharaoh in history, ruling for a remarkable 66 years. He was a military genius and an impressive builder, leaving behind awe-inspiring monuments like the temple complex of Abu Simbel and the magnificent Ramesseum. One of the most famous female pharaohs was Cleopatra. She was not only beautiful but also a skilled diplomat and linguist. She spoke multiple languages and forged alliances with powerful leaders like Julius Caesar and Mark Antony. The Egyptians worshipped a vast pantheon of gods and goddesses, each associated with different aspects of nature, society, and the afterlife. From powerful deities like Ra, the sun god, to compassionate goddesses like Isis, who symbolized motherhood and magic, these divine beings were deeply revered and sought guidance and protection. Mythology is filled with fascinating stories of creation, epic battles, and magical journeys. The story of Osiris, the god of the afterlife, and his treacherous brother Seth, showcases themes of resurrection and justice. 
One popular myth involves the mighty falcon-headed god Horus and his epic struggle against the chaotic forces of Seth. This symbolic battle between order and chaos was believed to play out in the natural world, reflecting the eternal struggle between good and evil. All the evidence leads von Donneken to conclude that the pyramid is linked to the arrival of visitors from outer space, and that they may have used it as a marking place, a map reference for navigation. Some researchers of the ancient astronaut theory believe that ancient Egyptians received knowledge and guidance from technologically advanced extraterrestrial beings. Proponents of this theory argue that certain ancient Egyptian artifacts, such as the pyramids and hieroglyphs, depict advanced technology and spacecraft, possibly indicating alien involvement. During the reign of Pharaoh Ramses II, a captivating tale unfolded. Legend has it that one night, as the sky shimmered with celestial lights, a being unlike any seen before descended upon the land. Clad in a radiant garment, this enigmatic visitor possessed an ethereal aura, radiating wisdom and power. Some believed they were an emissary from distant stars, while others saw them as a disguised deity. In the presence of Ramses II, the celestial visitor bestowed ancient knowledge and advanced wisdom. They spoke of the interconnectedness of the earthly and cosmic realms, inspiring the pharaoh to undertake grand architectural projects like the awe-inspiring Abu Simbel temples. Guided by this celestial mentor, Ramses II's reign became synonymous with wisdom, prosperity, and remarkable achievements. Yet, like a fleeting comet, the visitor eventually departed, leaving behind a legacy of wonder and mystery. I'm super excited to hear what you all think about this topic. So don't be shy, leave a comment down below and let your thoughts flow. Before you go, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you for being a part of this awesome community.